Okay, so first thing I'm going to start with is with a primer. I'm using the Urban Decay eyeshadow primer. I'm literally going to put this all over my eye and down here and blend it till it feels kind of tacky. Now I'm using NYX eyeshadow base <laughs> in skin tone and I'm going to use a Zoeva 142 brush and I'm just going to apply this product all over the lid. Now I'm going to set it with translucent powder. I'm just going to use the airspun with the same brush and I'm just going to apply it all over the lid. So now I'm going to use my 35B from Morphe and I'm going to use this light green and I'm actually going to use that as a transition shade. And I'm just going to go right into above my crease. This is just going to be my transition shade of course since I told you guys. Now I'm going to grab a smaller brush. This is the Rose Gold Zoeva brush in 221. And I'm going to go with this darker green and I'm going to apply this into my crease. And slowly I'm just going to build the colors up until we get the, the colors that I have over here. Using the same palette I'm going to grab this darker green right here with the same brush. And I'm going to apply this on the outer V and inner corner and then kind of blend it into the crease and just build up the color. And I'm just going back with my brush and I'm just blending the edges. I'm not applying more product, I'm just blending away. I hate having to show you so many palettes but I don't own a really intense black so the only intense black that I own it's in here in the Sahara palette. And I'm going to use Chad in here with a Soho brush. This is so old. I got it at Walmart a long time ago. And I'm going to apply this color on the outer, inner and outer corners. And blend a little bit into the crease. And always do not forget to blend. With nothing on this brush, I'm just going to blend the edges. I'm going to apply some glitter glue. This is the NYX glitter glue. And I'm just going to apply this all over the center of the lid just to make the eyeshadow pop even more. With a flat synthetic brush, I'm just going to brush on the glitter glue on the center of my lid. With another flat brush, I'm going to go with Molly from the Masquerade palette <laughs> and I'm just going to grab this shade and I'm going to apply it on top of the glitter glue. And then I'm going to go ahead and go back with my brush and just blend the edges. That way they won't be so harsh. Everything just looks very well blended. Now I'm going to grab the Saharan palette and I'm going to go with would it be which is this gold goldy yellow color and I'm just gonna apply it right in the center but I'm not gonna apply it too too much I just want like a little bit of a pop of gold I'm just gonna clean up the mess that I made right here and the outer corner I don't get a lot of follow with this but it just gets messy Okay, so now I'm just going to use a white eyeliner. This is by Italia Deluxe. I got it on eBay and I really, really like this eyeliner. And I don't know why. I just like it. I'm going to wait till this eyeliner dries so I can take off the axis that it got on my lash. Now with a spoolie, I'm just going to take off the white eyeliner that got onto my lashes. For mascara, I'll be using the Urban Decay Mascara in Bigger, Blacker, Better. Better. <laughs> so I'm going to go back with the mascara palette. Uh, I'm going to use Cairo. 
and I'm going to apply this on my lower lash line. For eyeliner, I'm going to be using this one by me now in gold, and I'm just going to apply this color on my waterline. And now I'm just going to apply some mascara on my lower lashes. For my inner corner, I'm just going to go with Giza. I really like this shade for my inner corner. You're probably going to see me use it a lot in almost every single video. I don't own that many eyeshadows. So, yeah. So now I'm just going to tightline my eye. Just like around where the white line is just to have like a little base for my um for my eyelashes and i'm using the scandalized 24 hour wear in black and i'm just gonna go really really close into my lashes for lashes i'll be using these extra long ones that i was telling you guys that i got on the wish app so look them up the glue that I'll be using is the Black Duo glue. I really like this one because it comes in a brush and all you have to do is brush it on the rim of the lashes. And that's it. You just wait a little bit to, so it'll get tacky and go ahead and apply to my eyeballs. For primer today, I'm just going to use this sample. It's a, the Too Faced Hangover replenishing freight phrase <laughs> face primer and I'm just gonna apply this as you guys all know the instructions is to apply all over your face so first I like to start with a concealer also to clean up my under eye this is the H rewind in fair and I just like to kind of like clean up under my eye like this I also like to put some on my nose to get rid of some of the redness and I just use my brush and I'm good. For foundation today, I'm going to use the Milani 2-in-1 in Creamy Vanilla, which is the 01. And first, I like to apply this with my finger first and kind of like spread it around. And then I like to blend with my brush first. And then I go with my beauty blender. I'm sorry my video stopped recording. Um, I don't remember where I stopped, but I used my um, contour from Kat Von D to contour, and now I'm with my bronzer. Um, I'm just going to warm up my face just a tiny bit. Okay, so for a highlight, I'm going to use my Jeffree Star in Eclipse. And I'm going to use this brush that I got from Coastal Scents. And I'm just going to grab some of this product and go crazy. For blush, I'll be using a Milani blush in Romantic Rose. This is like my favorite lately. For the lips, I'm going to apply Daddy. Um, I'm not sure if it'll look good with this look, but let's try it out. And now that we're done, I'm going to set my face with the Infallible Pro Spray Set. Mm. 
And that is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you want to see more videos coming soon, um, subscribe and don't forget to click on the little bell down there. That way it notifies you every time that I post a new video. So yeah guys, I love you. Thank you for subscribing and watching me and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.